we are here at rock face rock face is a huge spot here at crossbar a lot of people come here to be able to hang out and see it it's really awesome so we've already done a video of this but i'm actually going to show you guys a different angle and of different people doing it so last time you saw josh she came up the right hand side the far right hand side is considered to be rock face but there are a couple different lines that you can take um, as always, if you guys haven't already, make sure you guys click that subscribe button, make sure you click that like button, and let's show you guys what it looks like from the top down. All right, so as you can see there, there's another Jeep that's taking that line, but you actually can see that this is the line that we're trying to get through. So Corey is trying to dry off his tires at the moment, so you are going to cross through that water. You wanna make sure that you take it nice and slow. If you don't, then you're going to push water up onto the rock, which is gonna make it a whole lot more difficult for you. You wanna make sure that you avoid that hole right there so you can see that he is trying to push himself up to this tree over here and then once you actually get the grip then it's not going to take you very long to actually just do the whole entire line so you can do this with lockers or you can do this without lockers so here you can see Sinjin he's taking the line real slow going through that water just making sure that he's not pushing it up and then uh, as always you're going to just work your tires back and forth just work them so that way you dry them off and then once you get that line, then you're good to go. Cheryl, she is new to off-roading. She's doing this without lockers and she's probably the least built out of our group at this moment. So knowing that she can do this, you can definitely do this. You just have to make sure you have somebody experienced with you, somebody that can tell you where to go, what to do. If not, then make sure you have a radio. That way you have a good spotter. They can get you a little bit more information and tell you kind of what's working, what's not working. Take this part slow, Cheryl, because if you go too fast and slide back down, your front end's gonna pop up. Ooh, yeah, get it, girl. Every vehicle approaches this obstacle in a different manner. However, what stays consistent is drying off the tires, ensuring that you're aiming for that tree to avoid those large holes, and just taking this slow. This is definitely a doable obstacle. However, if you try to take it too quickly, you will pop that front end up like I told Cheryl earlier, and nobody wants to go tumbling down any hills. This is something that we hope you guys have enjoyed. We'll continue to bring you guys some content and hope that you continue to enjoy. Don't forget to press that like button, subscribe if you haven't, and share us with your friends if you really like what we're doing. Also, make sure you check the description. We're trying to give you guys as many of the GPX files as we have for this location, and I know a lot of you have asked for that, so check it out down below. As always, just keep on jeeping, and we'll see you guys next time.